I'm inside Shopabot and I want to show you something real quick. I'm going to get to the fast uh, start video and I'll allow the video to basically take over and so you can see what this is all about. All right, during this video, we are going to see how quickly we can set up our first shop. We're going to get started by clicking on Activate Shop and we need to give this a name. We're going to call this Video Games Rule and click on Activate Now. And once I have that created, we can see it is now down here and we are going to click on Manage Shop. And once we are inside of the Manage Shop option, at any time we can click on View Shop at the top right and see exactly what our shop looks like as we are making changes. The first thing you need to be sure that you do when you go inside of your shop is go into the Shop section here, click on Keys, and you want to update this with your Amazon Access Key and your Access Secret. We have another tutorial video that walks you through exactly how to find your Amazon API keys. So be sure to watch that video and update this section here. Something else we need to do is go into our categories and configure our categories to match the theme of our shop. For example, we are going to click on category one. We're going to go inside of here and go to edit. We're going to change our menu name to actually say video games. And for the department, we're going to change this from all departments to video games down here at the bottom. And then we can also enter a niche or product name here. So I can enter PS4 for example. And last but not least, we have the ability to use a header slide and we can search here, you know, cat for example, uh, let's see game for me. And I can select these game tokens, select it and then click on update category one. And now if I navigate back over here, I click on category one It now says video games and we can see everything is related to the PS4, which was the keyword that I had entered. And all my categories here on the left are related to video games. And we also have our header slider here at the top. So the next thing that I would do is run through here and change these other categories to be other video game terms, maybe Xbox, PC gaming, accessories, things like that. If there is a category that you do not want to use, you can simply delete it from the shop. The next thing that I would do is go into my site settings. And from here, we can add our Google Analytics code. We can change our contact information and our social links here at the bottom. We can also change our site name. Instead of my shop name, we can go ahead and edit this and we can call this video games rule, update my site name. And then I can update my logo as well and my fave icon. Same thing for our theme cover. We can come in here and change the color of the overall theme. Let's go ahead and go with a red, for example, update my theme color. Now, if we head over here and refresh this, just to kind of see how things are going and we can see my color has changed. My categories are good. My shop's good. And the last thing that I would do is set up a giveaway so I can dive into my giveaways here. We can see that we currently have one giveaway set up. I'm going to go ahead and edit this giveaway and you'll see we have our giveaway page, what it looks like, our thank you page and our autoresponder integration. Now we also have another tutorial video dedicated to showing you how to set up this giveaway page, the thank you page and the autoresponder integration. And that's all there is to setting up your shop. It's as simple as coming into your shop, editing your categories, the keywords, the search terms and the departments that you want to use for your shop. And just like that, we have hundreds and even thousands of niche products on a store set up with our affiliate details. Okay. That's pretty powerful. That shop a bot, pick it up from the links below. I mean, I don't know how else I can explain this, but, uh, I, I'm, I'm gonna, I'm gonna try it out. I mean, I've got one shop that I can activate and that's pretty cool. Uh, and, uh, let me just check something out right here. So one, one shop is like this one right here. And this is like, I got to fix up the logo. It's a demo shop. All right. Uh, showing you, uh, you can build a store right away from uh, Shopabot's uh, back office thing. So I'm going to go ahead and activate my store. Just like uh, you've seen in the demo below. I'm giving you a quick demo on how this works and how simple it is. Uh, it's available and create. So now it's building my store and I've got a store ready. I don't even need a domain. This is based on uh, the Shopabot's own server and which is pretty cool. So I'm going to go ahead and manage store and I'm going to do what it told me. I'm going to go into my categories and I'm going to edit stuff and then I'm going to start sending traffic to it. And then I need to add my affiliate links as well. 
but they're going to teach you all that information in there. All right. I'm not going to do it right now, but I'm going to allow you to actually uh, go through it yourself. Check out the links below. And I hope you enjoyed this quick uh, review on Shopabot, which is launched. Okay. So I'm still fixing this. I'm building this and I'll talk to you soon.